Amy Smith, Reading Recovery Teacher Leader with Madison County Schools. Hello, I'm Tommy Floyd, Superintendent with Madison County Schools. We're glad you joined us today because we want to share with you the good news of what Reading Recovery is doing for students of Madison County. Read to Achieve is a state-funded literacy grant program that pays for highly skilled early intervention teachers. Reading Recovery is an early intervention training model aimed at eliminating literacy problems in the hardest to teach children. Reading Recovery is the foundation of our Read to Achieve program in that it provides long-term training for teacher participants. Rather than depending upon a published program, our teachers are equipped with a high degree of knowledge and skill that enables them to make responsive teacher decisions for the hardest to teach children. Our district philosophy is that it takes skilled, observant teachers to address the unique difficulties of each student, something no individual published program could provide. Today we will share data that illustrate the success of our RTA programs in three ways. The first is the actual number of students reached by these programs. The second is the progress that students make while they're being served in the, in the interventions. The third is the sustained longitudinal gains over time. We believe that these three pieces of data will illustrate the overall success of our programs. When you consider the fact that we experience reading recovery due to a state-granted program and that Read to Achieve funds enable us to offer these intense, one-on-one, -on -one responsive uh, sessions with students, we're very, very grateful. We wanted to prepare this video to share with you, uh, Kentucky Department of Education officials, legislators, and all supporters of children and literacy, what Read to Achieve and Reading Recovery are doing for us, and we think you're going to like the results. For those less familiar with Reading Recovery or any literacy program, let me put it this way. The students that Dr. Smith is talking about, somewhere around 5,000 students, used to be Madison County's lowest performing readers, some almost non-readers. These students, almost 5,000, have joined the ranks of proficiency. That's a very powerful thing when considered in our district total. The progress of reading recovery children is compared to a national sample comprised of two randomly selected students from each reading recovery school. What you see here is a graph depicting the text reading level gains over the course of the year of reading recovery students and the random sample students. The data illustrates that fall entry reading recovery students began the year much lower than the random sample. Over the course of the year, however, you can see that the reading recovery children closed the achievement gap in text reading in comparison to the random sa sample. In fact, when you compare the mean gain over the course of the year, you can see that the reading recovery children outgained the, the random sample group in terms of text reading level. This graph represents that comparison that Dr. Smith was referring to. The mean gain in text level reading by the reading recovery students compared to the national norm group is easy to get excited about. Here these students have demonstrated a much faster higher gain in reading levels. This final piece of data illustrates the sustained gains of reading recovery students over time. It also illustrates how powerful this intervention has been on the total population of students and our eventual test scores. If you look at the pie chart, it represents all proficient and distinguished readers in Madison County. Notice the blue section. Those are former Reading Recovery students. So in essence, 35% of our proficient and distinguished fourth graders had been former Reading Recovery students. How beneficial has Reading Recovery been to Madison County Schools? We'll let these faces tell the story. Think about the life that these students will now lead, a life of literacy, because of a continued investment by the state of Kentucky in reading recovery and the Read to Achieve funding. Thank you to every single person who has given this gift of literacy to each of these beautiful faces. In closing, 
we want to express how proud we are of each and every one of our reading recovery teachers. Their dedication to their expertise and their passion in seeing these struggling readers become proficient is just almost overwhelming. We hope you've enjoyed our video. It was our way of saying thank you to many.